the earth from above, the face of the earth, its range and its depth, its scope, its breadth. But at certain angles, in certain light, the earth looks out with a different face. The scratches, the wounds, the burns and the scars apparent now in this climate of change. Now the weather has taken a turn for the worse. Uh, for me, it's a, it's a catastrophe. It's dramatic what's happening. You can't have sustainable communities with strip mining. With every lump of coal we mine, we get poorer and poorer. But here and now, across the globe, there are those who think with a different mind, who are pitching in or drawing a line, who are underwhelmed by the size of it all, who are taking it on one bit at a time, atom by atom, drop by drop, little by little, grain by grain. They are making choices that make for change. I just have to be one of them people to say, hey, Enough's enough. If we're going to be all blinded by the money, that's the end of us. As indigenous people, we are the best friend, we are the best steward of the environment. We are going to deal with, survive, prevent climate change. <laughs>